Hello everyone, nice to meet you. My name is Duvan and today's video I'm going to talk about short name or abbreviation. Let's begin. So what is abbreviation or what is short name? Maybe you are making that question. So when we speak about abbreviation, we refer to a phrase that is shorted uh, by uh, to a word. So a word or phrase is shorted to a word or a letter. For example, we have apartment. Apartment is short is shorted to A P T period. So we have another example, doctor. Doctor, we said D R period. Information, we say info or I F F O uh, period. So this is abbreviation. So we are going to see more about it. So we have three types, three types of sharing or abbreviation. So we are going to speak about them. Let me check. For example, number one. So we have clipping. So uh, clipping. Sometimes uh, abbreviations are also formed by omitting so one or more syllable from a word or a phrase. Uh, in this case, we call clipping. Why? Bec why we call clipping? Because the beginning of the word was keep and clip the rest of the word, and sometimes uh, we keep uh, the the end of the word and clip the rest of the word. So let's gonna check some examples so that to understand better this point. We have here some examples. See, so we have clipping in the end. For example, we have advert advertisement. So hack hackney. So mic microphone tar tarpaulin. So we can check that we have a word uh, and we pull the word with a next information, right? With another information. So we have another examples in the beginning. So we have burger, hamburger. So in the beginning, right? We add more more to confirm a word. Adventure, adventure, spy, despite, phone, telephone, right? This is clipping examples. Now I'm gonna tell you and speak about acronyms and initial teams. These are another uh, types of abbreviation that are very important. We really need to know about them. So when we speak about acronyms, we we refer a type of abbreviation that usually takes uh, the first letter of the, of a series of words and can be pronounced. So uh, initial teams, uh, these are together because word together. These are, uh, we can say that are the same, but these are not the same. So they, this has a short, short uh, different. And I'm gonna tell you, right? So we have acronyms. So when, when we speak about acronyms, we pronounce as a full word. For example, we have NATO, NATO. So Maybe you can say, no, 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 I, I can pronounce N, A, T, O, no. For that reason, it says acronyms. Acronyms say that you can say uh, uh, the first letter of the word, but you pronounce all the words. So North Atlantic Treaty Organization, this means NATO. So TOEFL, this is so, this is so famous word, TOEFL. Test of English as a foreign language. So we have... We have NASA, uh, National Aeronautics and Space Administration, POTUS, NASCAR, National Associations for Stock Car Auto Racing. But in the other side, we have uh, intelligence. So what is intelligence? It's the same two acronyms, but we don't pronounce the, the, the first letter, right? For example, if you say that initialism is the same two acronyms, you, you can say USA, but it's incorrect. So uh, uh, many people say USA and this is incorrect. So we say USA, United States of America. For example, another mistake that I hear very, very, very common 
uh, is CIA, is incorrect. So we say CIA, CIA, Central Intelligence Agency. So we have another example here, New York City, NYZ, and um, CNN. So we have uh, many words that could be confirmed like uh, in Italy things we have more words and we have more words that can be pronounced like acronyms except for example F B I we can say F period B period I period but we can use it without periods it the same uh, it could be the same right so this is all thanks for watching this video this art reference uh, about my job my homework and thanks so much remember that here and take care thank you